guys welcome back to my java tutorials and today's video is last video about the constructor in this video you will understand the difference between method and constructor in syntax point of view and execution point of view both we will see here and just to recap so far we have seen what is a constructor its syntax the type of constructors what is constructor overloading and this keyword in constructor if you are watching this video directly, please go ahead and watch those four videos so that you will be in track and understand completely the concepts. Now let's see the difference between method and constructor. Let us create a constructor first. Public and Java constructor is the class name. This is the constructor syntax. And let's create a method now. Public wide new method so access modifier it may be public private or static here for method creation your constructor should be always public and the second difference is we have a return type here for the constructor we doesn't have any return type and the third one is method name method name you should give whatever name you want new method new name new user it doesn't matter whatever you want you can give it here and an end of the method name you have to give open and closing parentheses but here if i change this one immediately it throws the compile time error so the name of the constructor name is always your class name this is the first part of my topic the syntax and the next one is calling a constructor and method let's see that now print a statement Hi viewers, let's print one more statement here saying that let's give something different here. Hi, this is a method. Let's change here also. This is a constructor for better understanding. So, so far we created a constructor and method. Constructor returns a statement and the method also returns one statement. So far it's clear, right? Now let us go on create a object. Without object, we cannot invoke any of them. That is the first and basic point. There is no doubt about it. Now let's create a object. New class name obj new class name. Can anyone guess what will happen if I run the program without calling anything? Okay, let's see. Let's see. Hi viewers, this is a constructor. So even though we are not calling here anything, the constructor is invoked as soon as you created the object but if you want to call a method you need to call the method name specifically obj dot and new user then only the method is invoked or called yep. got it that's all for today tutorial guys i believe you understand the concept very well see you in my next video stay tuned and happy learning